Hi there, Daphne and the beautiful babies. Um, so this is Riverside. This is the front entry. It has these columns here, the dental molding up top. Um, I'm going to turn around so you can see the circular driveway here. goes through there. Kind of gives you an idea as well of the area. Uh, River Oaks is one of the premier areas within the loop of Memphis, the 240 loop. You can see it's got a really long porch. Um, besides a few walls nests and dirt daubers here and there, couldn't really see anything separating uh, on the front porch area. So here is the side of the home, extensive landscaping. Let's take you on the inside. About 4,400 square feet. Here is the front entry. Seems like it's probably been a while since anybody's been here. Um, you got a tall vaulted ceiling entry. The stairs are to the left of the front door. Uh, and this is the... Okay, so this is the front foyer area here. You have um, access to more natural light. They have some curtains up there. So when you walk in the house, to the right is the living room, formal. I always tell people these are great places for an office with some double French doors. And to the left over here is the formal dining room. Here we go. And of course the, the carpet is worn in the floor and on the staircase, but that's obviously very cosmetic. I wanna show you around kind of like the rim of the room as well, smooth ceiling. And from there we go into the kitchen. Here's an expansive, more expansive view. This is the uh, breakfast area here and over here have the pantry. Okay, butcher block countertops. All this is obviously very cosmetic. And even these cabinets here, man, they look like they're in perfect condition. Could be painted or changed, just whatever. And then over here is where you have uh, all this additional great, great storage. And through here, let's see. Where's my light? Okay. So this is the area off the kitchen leading into, that's some more pantry space there. Um, uh, broom closet. Uh, here's your guest bath. Actually, this is a full bath. Okay. Yeah, a full shower in here. Anytime I see a full shower, I look for an opportunity for an additional bedroom. So, this, I thought it said it was one bedroom down, and maybe this is it. Maybe the master is up. So, this is, uh, it's got a closet. It's a room. It's small. It's got this, well, you see the carpet. It probably, back in the day, went with the, curtains here's the windows here um so that would uh, accompany this bedroom this full closet um since i'm on this side i'm gonna go ahead and <clears throat> go upstairs and get some light. okay <coughs> so we got orange carpet on the stairs leading to this bonus area and then it looks like the indoor outdoor orange carpet that's the too much of that okay that's the attic and this is the bonus really big space for kiddos right oh this will lead to the upstairs so i'll finish downstairs as far as condition Uh, 
like like you just got a little settling here um, that look like painters tape and it feels pretty sturdy the windows here are not double pane so let's continue try to be brief these longer videos take longer to load okay let's see so from the kitchen back to the kitchen um walk into this huge den with this burl wood um walls and if you like it i do this beautiful uh, flooring, wood flooring, parquet. But you see, it's uh, not just your regular parquet. This is really, wow, gorgeous. Look like they even shined it up. On the other side, you have built-in bookcases um, behind the kitchen. So you do have to wonder um, if you can knock some of this wall out and make it wider within the den okay there's a closet under the stair and um a little bar area here okay um and then off the den is a sunroom, okay? Hmm. Space here. Oh. Okay, so this is a garage here. <laughs> yeah, it looks like everything is probably original. Just one of those situations where they took care of it. No um, modern updates. So this is actual storage. Actually, this is the laundry room. Okay, so the laundry room, you cross the sunroom and you get to that. It's still on the inside. Let me get you to the other side of the house. Okay. So yeah, it's like they took care of it, but no updates. Um, but it feels sturdy as heck. Okay, well, actually the master is down here. So, this, I'm sure, would be the master. Here's the bath. You walk in from the den. There's a door, so you have additional privacy. Behind that is the linen closet. Okay. And walk into the wallpaper here. Wow. I could see that coming back. Um, it matches the, the curtains. So this is the full bath. Yeah. Everything is, uh, yeah. Good shape. Look at this. <laughs> a tub that all that clean. And then you have a window here, the toilet. There's a shower area. God, how do you have a shower this old and this clean? Y'all, it's clean, okay? <laughs> So, um, through there, we got the orange, the burnt orange, Auburn orange carpet. Not to be confused with Tennessee orange. And the walls are kind of like a peachy orange. Kind of between Auburn and UT orange. And then you have a nice walk-in closet here. It's got natural lighting, a window there. So, again, if I'm not mistaken, if I recall correctly, it said one bedroom down, but it's actually two. The master and that little bitty one way on, over on the other side, which could be good. It's like an in-law suite. Oh, countertops match the shower. Okay. 
and let's take a stroll upstairs here here going through the front entry some nice wood under this carpet okay let's veer to the left have a good nice obviously this is a girl's room here pink ceilings are very smooth I'm not seeing any, any separation in the crown molding here. Has two windows facing the front. Let's see. Here's the bathroom. Got a sink on this side here. And it does Jack and Jill. This is attic space here. Um, linen closet. Bathtub here. And another linen closet. Yeah. And this is the other side. So this is pink as well. Like two two girls or four girls or however many girls perfect space for sharing this is in the closet let's see and this would be yeah. ooh, more attic space let me see if i can i might see something <laughs> okay that's attic you got a little storage in there actually Okay. Um, so, from this room, there is, wow, okay. So, this is where that bonus room connects. You see a door here, and then this is where you enter the girl's room. And through here is a closet. This is a closet. And this is, oh, what is that? Hmm. I guess it's access to the um, units or something. Okay. Yeah, so the carpet obviously, again, needs to be changed. I am going to... Go and turn this light out here. Guess I did not. No, I did. That's natural light. Okay, anyway. <laughs> you have another door here in this hall for more storage. Let me get a light. See here? This is great storage. Wow. We can never have too much of that. Here's another door. Just so along this whole hall, they have um, inserted storage. And then this is another attic space. Okay. Not a lot of access. Got some ductwork in there. Okay. So that is the side that goes to that bonus area. And again, the Jack and Jill girls bathrooms and let's get you on the other side so now we have two additional bedrooms on the other side everybody can have their own bedroom so here cut the curve and there is a closet and this has a full on suite for this bedroom. This is kind of a linen area. Well, I take that back. It has a sink for this side, and just like the girl side, it flows. It, it shares a Jack and Jill. I said girls, but I may want to put the boys on that side. Okay, so here's the laundry area that's upstairs. Um, and uh, 
let's get some light here. You have curtains that match the wallpaper. Also in the bathroom. So in this room, I am noticing, let me turn the light off, you can see it better. A couple of, looks like wet spots here. Again, this is the laundry. It goes up. So, let's see here. Okay. Looks like this is gonna be a big attic space. Let me take a peep. Yep. Yeah. Right. I got my running shoes on. Uh, go so, lots of storage. Wow. It's clear, it's clean as a whistle up here. You got a pitch roof. I guess if you wanted to build this out, some you could, or just great attic space, storage. Alrighty. So that's it. You got four separate bedrooms upstairs. I'm going to show you some of the back from up here. Huge backyard. I will show you the backyard on another video. They tend to do a little better in uploading if they don't run this long. So... Um, get these lights out. Okay. It's a really, really good setup. Okay. So that's it for the inside. Let me show you this over the stair here. Down at the bottom, you can see that big window. Let me know if you have questions on the inside.